Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Petra and you're on Divine Essence. Um, this channel is going to be all about fragrance and fragrance reviews. And um, today we're going to be talking about, boom, <laughs> One Kiss by Frank Olivier. Um, I want to talk about this fragrance because it is affordable, very. So anybody can, pretty much anyone and everyone can afford this. It's eight, I found it for $18.66 online. I think it was FragranceX.com that I bought this fragrance at. Um... Please excuse the color variation in my in my film. I don't know what's going on, but I'm using a government phone, literally. Anyway, <laughs> better quality uh, footage coming up soon. Anyway, so yeah, this is uh, One Kiss by Frank Olivier, and this is the bottle. It has a little heart mosaic on the back, and I love that. Such a romantic little bottle, perfect for Valentine's Day, if you ask me. Um, this fragrance opens up with a mandarin italian mandarin actually <laughs> pear and then it's mixed in with some white florals and it has a very bright opening and then it goes it transitions very quickly in like a matter of like 20 minutes or so into the dry down which is a, a musky sandalwood -y, like vanilla but honestly it's more like a flat vanilla and sandalwood if you ask me um it's kind of just like a skin tint at that point so this is definitely not like a beast mode fragrance whatsoever this is not a fragrance that you excuse me <laughs> this is not the show must go on I don't care I'm not allowing my gear to be an excuse not to put my shit out and help and do the things I want to do because at this point in my life guys to be honest with you I'm broke so this is all I got, and this is what I'm going to use. And all the distractions, I don't even have anything to edit this video with. So guess what? And I don't want to sit there forever and, and deal with the free editing apps that come on my phone because it's just hard on the screen, and I'm not doing it. So this is going to be one take, and I don't care what distractions come around. I'm still going to review this fragrance. Boom, for those distractions. Anyway, sorry. Yeah, anyways, let me go back into my... <laughs> Um, this fragrance is not a beast mode. I don't remember what I was saying, so let's just roll with it. This fragrance is not a beast mode fragrance. And it is, um, I would compare it to the quality of Choco Musk by Al Rehab. It is um, a bright opening with man uh, Italian mandarin pear and white florals. And then after 20 minutes, like I said, it dries down to like a sandalwood and a uh, vanilla and it's actually quite a nice little skin scent yes and the skin scent lasts for about on me it lasts for about two hours and the opening only lasts for about like 15 minutes if that and it's uh the middle notes of it only lasts for like like 10 minutes it's really weird and it smells like with the everything together like the fruits the white florals the sandalwood and the vanilla it smells like cinnamon to me which i really like but it's only for a very short period of time that it smells like that right so definitely not something that's beast mode definitely not something that's date night or anything other than like puttering around the house netflix and chilling with somebody that you're going to be close to um running errands stuff like that a little pick me up throughout the day when you just like first of all i think this bottle is uplifting anyway it's so cute it has a heart on it it's cute love it and then on top of the cuteness of the bottle the fragrance the fragrance itself is nice and uplifting if you ask me especially in the beginning um yeah so definitely uh it's it's, you get what you pay for with this one. I definitely use it. I put this little bottle on, on my countertops. And um, when I look at it, it just makes me feel happy. So I thought, hey, let me share this little gem that I found with people. Yeah? yeah I hope you guys can see it. Yeah? Um, <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah. Uh, this is called One Kiss by Frank Olivier. Definitely not a beast mode. Definitely something for um, hanging out around the house, for just running errands or whatever. Um, a little pick-me-up fragrance. It doesn't last very long, but it's quite lovely, actually, for the price. Yeah, they did a good job. I just, honestly, I wish that this company would take this fragrance and the, the idea of what this fragrance is. And I wish that they would redo it and put only fine quality ingredients in this. 
take the same concept of it, just add like more fine in uh, ingredients, make it like last longer, make it richer, make it finer, and then take more like sandalwood and musk and like really like amplify that and make it deeper and more like intoxicating. And then I would say put a little bit of incense in the bottom, a little bit of cinnamon in this fragrance, a little bit of uh, candied rose, like a li actually quite a bright, like ruby, like hard candy type of candy rose. I don't know. I think that would just be really good in here. And honestly, if they did that, I feel like this fragrance would be unstoppable. I think it would be on top of everybody's list. And yeah, so, but if you guys want to know what I'm talking about in terms of like, being, it being a pick-me-up and smelling bright in the beginning with white florals and mandarin orange and pear and then drying down to like a, a nice skin scent of sandalwood and, uh, sandalwood and vanilla and just like being lovely for $18. I mean, why not? Um, I don't think you can go wrong. Um, you can check it out. You can find it online for cheap on many different sites. You can, yeah, fragrance, any type of discount fragrance stores has it. You could just Google it. You got this. All right. There you go. One kiss, Frank Olivier. And that's it for today. I'm only doing that one fragrance because I feel like this one was the epitome of Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day is coming up. And I'm not going to be celebrating with anyone except for myself. And I will be putting on my Frank Olivier one kiss. And I will be rocking it. And I will be happy because that's what I want to be. So with that being said, that's all I got for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed my little ditty. Uh, of, of like a review um, I will be making more content in the future and hopefully one day sorry better quality of my camera my videos and also editing editing I think I'm gonna love editing so expect that in the future I'm sorry that there's a little bit uh, <laughs> just bear with me the, the fragrance review is still the same like everything I'm saying is what I'm saying so you want to, if you are, have been looking to try a new fragrance and you don't have that much money to spend, or hey, if you, even if you do, you just want to try a little, a little something, try this out. I really think you'll like it. And also, if you have tried it, or if you're going to try it and you want, or if you want to try it and then you plan and you do try it, uh, <laughs> please leave a comment in uh, the comment section below and let me know how you like it. And if you guys have any, like, anything you want me to review, that would be cool. Alright, so thank you again. My name is Petra and you're watching Divine Essence. Um, see you guys next time and take care. Until next time, take care of yourselves. Bye.